Rumor has it. Rumor, rumor has it. Call out a name or you gossiping or you chatty patty. I am gossiping. This is the Rumor Report. I mean, I guess we on The Breakfast Club. This is where the tea spills, right? Yes. Right. On The Breakfast Club. So Kiki Palmer stars in Usher's new music video for the single Boyfriend following the Vegas controversy. You remember that, guys? Mm -hmm. So the single comes after Kiki Palmer attended Usher's Vegas show where he's, what is he called? The domestic terrorist now, y'all? He's definitely a man. (laughs) So he serenaded. She was serenaded by Usher. Uh, Somebody said that your boyfriend is looking for me. Usher sings in a clip uh, from the song titled Boyfriend. I'm excited about this one. So both he and Palmer... Um, are shared in the social media a clip. I think we got some audio, Eddie. Somebody say that your boyfriend's looking for me. That's a little bounce, no? We don't Man, want it. Usher we is like a it. menace. Right. You know, <laughs> Kiki baby daddy got to get into a studio <laughs> right now. Somebody get Kiki Palmer's baby daddy to hit him up instrumental or eat the instrumental or back to back instrumental. Something. Well, oh. Could you imagine though? Lord I have a have problem mercy. with my girl going, right? right my baby right, mama right. going. Then you do a song and you in the video. Is this petty betty or is this the setup? First of all, that's clearly not his girl anymore. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> but, but let me add this. Usher Jeez. also tweeted a short caption for the video telling his followers that the impeding duet represents when fantasies become reality. Yeah, I, I felt right to say that. Before. So this officially drops um, tomorrow. So you can hit the link in our bio for more info. No, actually today, the 16th. What's today? The 16th. My days are off. So, yeah, today at 10 a.m. So you could click the link in our bio and watch that. She looked cute, though, in the video. She got some purple. What you think, is Charlamagne? What, what going I'm on? just thinking that Usher made a whole diss record to <laughs> Kiki Palmer's baby daddy and a video. Why? Is he it really sure or did he capitalize on, you know, nah, that's a hey, good point. make it make sense for you. But that's why, that's why Usher's one of the best to ever do it because he's not tweeting about it. He's not doing no interviews about it. He did what all artists should do. Musically. And that's turn whatever is going on in the news and this some music. But what does the boyfriend do now? I just told you, you better get in the studio <laughs> if you know what I know. Okay. Let me tell you, all I got to say is, watch this. Damn. Y'all remember that? Damn. <laughs> That's my favorite. Watch this. Damn. Okay. Poor so, dude, man. Nah, is it? Or maybe they're both getting the coins and he's just going along with it. I don't know. That's my theory. So let's talk about this. Beehive, I know um, they're excited for Beyonce. She shouted out Lizzo uh, at her Atlanta show amid dancers' lawsuits. So Beyonce appeared to express her support for her fellow pop star Lizzo by shouting her out amid an ongoing lawsuit filed by Lizzo's former dancers. I'm sure by now a lot of people have heard about it. So during a performance of Break My Soul, the Queen's remix, um, on Monday night, uh, Beyonce name dropped Lizzo saying, I love you Lizzo! Something like that. We gotta... I kind of said it the same. I love you Lizzo! No? Well, why why are we acting like this isn't part of the show? She's always been shy. Yeah, exactly yeah. When the break my but she never said I, she she never said I love you, Lizzo. She just oh, goes, she just Lizzo, said the name? Kelly oh, okay. Rowland, no, this person. I, I think stitches. there was a show she took. It, she, Hey, she's there. I think she took her name out at one of the shows. That's why people were like, Because mm, she said Erica Badu. She said Erica Badu four times. Yeah, three, four she times. She usually said Erica Badu once, but she said it four times because that was the day. Erica Badu with the, with the hat. Yeah, it said Beyonce was biting her style with the hat or something. Okay, because mm. some people were assumed, were you know connecting that. Hey, we're getting maybe too she messy with that. this, man. We're <laughs> You pulling out a fan? Wait, too messy with can this I roll it? That's yeah, one yeah, of my yeah. hold it, hold it now, y'all. It's hold not even it. mess. Now, wait, People now. just be making wait. stuff up. Ready? <laughs> hold it. Oh! Hey. Stitches with the fan. <laughs> one more time. Okay. Yeah. She she do that better yeah. than you, Charlamagne. Yeah. I, gotta, I gotta watch Baby. you over there. Yeah. <laughs> you did that two times. Now my voice gonna change <laughs> with this. Make sure now. Ain't a little sprinkle, sprinkle. <laughs> 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 All right. May I continue? I feel yes, like ma'am. I need to talk yes, like ma'am. this. All right. Sorry. And don't judge me. Y'all know who know me. I go in and out of back sense. But now I got this fan. I got to change it. So little baby, I'm excited to see like he's jumping into new entrepreneur mm-hmm. um, endeavors. I always said he's not gonna rap forever. He's gonna be more so of a businessman. But I love his music. So little baby's loan forgiveness. Forgiveness, get this, there's a you know a pun on this. You know how you spell loan, L-O-A-N, right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But this is spelled L-O-G-N-E. L-O-G-N-E. Like cologne, but loan forgiveness. Let me finish it. Okay, so Lil Baby's loan forgiveness program mm-hmm. with Axe, get it? Uh. Provides, st- you got it, provides stimulus payments 
uh, for men in need. So in celebration of National Men's Grooming Day on August 18th, Axe and Lil Baby are teaming up to launch the brand new loan, the cologne forgiveness mm-hmm. program. Uh, so the program, we will see Axe and Lil Baby providing select fans with $150 towards the cost of their old cologne so they can buy the new Axe Fine Fragrance Collection. And they still have plenty of cash left over in their pocket. So one thing I've learned is that your price tag doesn't define your worth. That's what Lil Baby said. And y'all could smell just as fine with the new axe and keep building your cash in the meantime. So that's how you do it when you're the GOAT. That's what he said. I like that. So, so this is pretty cool, but let mm-hmm. me give you the deets. To de- be eligible for it, um, they're going to select. Okay, so to be eligible to receive one of the select 150 cash app payments, right? Fans must simply just drop their cash app. Your, your tag, your cash app mm-hmm, tag, mm-hmm. in the comments on the loan forgiveness post, which will be posted on TikTok. So mm-hmm. once it's posted, just put your cash app tag, right, at Teddy, Eddie, mm-hmm. and then, like, you can get $150. How, how many people are they picking? They're picking how many people? I think it's I think it's more. I don't even know. They don't okay. say. But let me give you the date. So mm-hmm. the first one is August 21st. Okay. And then the next one, August 28th, and then um, September 5th. Oh, they do have it. So 50, 50 on people. August 21st and then on the 28th, 25th, and then uh, the September 25th. So that's pretty cool. I yeah, like that. Little baby doing exactly what you're supposed to do. When you get in partnership with these corporations, you make these corporations uh, kick back money to the hood. Absolutely. Come on. That's it. Kick back money to the people who need it. And he's always had a heart for that, I see. So mm-hmm. shout out to Little Baby and, and, and Little Dirk. I know we were talking about. Shout out to Big Sue. She was talking about that as well. So mm-hmm. I like it. Cheers mm-hmm. to Little Baby and the artist doing good things. One that's more time. Right. There you go. No. Oh, hell. (laughs) There There we go. go. Thanks, guys. All right. Well, that is your rumor (laughs) report. Now, when we come back, we got front page news. Teslin Figueroa will be joining us. And then after that, Canelo Alvarez will be in the building. It's the Breakfast Club on BET. Wake that ass up. In the morning. The Breakfast Club.